Sabres hosting the Oilers, and the Oilers are minus 145 on the money line. The Sabres are plus 125. The over-under is seven goals. The Oilers laying a goal and a half are plus 142 on the puck line, while the Sabres getting a goal and a half are minus 200 on the puck line. The Oilers lost the last game that they played. The Sabres won the last game that they played. Now, mind you, these are the overnight odds. They're going to change the closer we get to puck drop tomorrow, and I have seen the over-under as high as seven and a half. Before you bet on this game, check out a site like VegasInsider.com. It's totally free and allow you to compare how all these casinos are pricing this game. And then if you want some head-to-head -head information, go to Covers.com. Totally free, and you can see how these teams have been doing individually, head-to-head, -head, or just against the spread. Now, head-to-head, -head, the home team is 6-4. and four. The Sabres are 7-3 and three against the Oilers in their last 10. The underdog is 7-3 and three on the money line. The underdog getting a goal and a half on the puck line is 8-2. and two. There have been five one-goal games in their last 10. The under is 6-4 and four in their last 10, and the under 7 is 6-1-3 and three in their last 10 games. The last game that they played, the Sabres won 4-2. The game before that, the Oilers won 6-1. The game before that, the, the Sabres won 3-2. The game before that, the Sabres won 3-2 in overtime. The game before that, the Sabres won 3-2 in overtime. Now, in their last handful of games overall, the Oilers are 3-7 and seven in their last 10. The last two games they've played have gone over. The over is 7-2-1 and one in their last 10. We've had 12 goals, 9 goals, 7 goals, and 5 goals. The Oilers have scored at least 2 goals in every one of their last 4 games, and they've scored 5-plus goals in 3 out of their last 4. Now for the Sabres, they are 6-4 in their last 10. The last 4 games they've played have gone over, and the over is 8-2. We've had 8 goals, we've had 8 goals, we've had 8 goals, and we've had 11 goals. The Sabres have scored 3-plus goals, Three times in that span, they scored one goal once. We've had five, three, and seven. For whatever the reason is, the Sabres play very well against the Oilers. They're a home underdog, and I've got this thing for home underdogs. I'm going to take the Sabres with the money line. I'm going to take the Sabres getting the goals, and I am going over in this game. Chances are the game will land on seven, but we shall see. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut, and please bet responsibly.